Yes, yes, yes. The skill acquisition project was very, very successful. The whole idea is to get entertainers to acquire skills. What we're saying is talent is not just good enough anymore. The begging must stop, the ailment must stop. You know, entertainers will start living a good life. That's really what the NGO stands for. At first, I wasn't quite sure if it was going to be an A1 project. I sounded it out with a lot of people, some entertainers, and they brought the idea. Initially, we wanted to train just about maybe eight to 10 people. We ended up um, having about 15, and eventually about 12 of us qualified. That's actually excluding myself. And that's an awful lot of number for a new NGO, you know, cost, you know, put into consideration. It was really very, very interesting. It really took my heart when I saw these young entertainers, the girls, the boys, young actors and actresses, and one particular footballer that's been into football for a very long time. What? We can make ends meet. When they said, if I really want to train to be able to fend for myself, I don't want to beg, I don't want to be looked down upon. And I thought, yeah, that's what we're really all about. And so it was really very successful. And we had the bath trial. I was really very shocked when he said he was coming to train and that he needed to acquire new skills, including equal gravity. That was really absolutely um, wonderful. And funny enough, I acquired the skills as well of soap making and bleach making. And eventually we, from bleach making, we now realize that that's how you get your scouring paste, which can be dried up to make um, scouring powder. We had it two weeks all together, you know, we broke it up. The day one we done the soap, our teacher was very, very good. You know, she's a qualified person. That's very important. We also did the entrepreneurship as well and had a class in that. The whole idea is, you know, you come learn a skill. We're talking about skills, not just soap making, you know, baking, also small chops, videography, you know, editing, babbing, makeup artistry, manicure, pedicure, weed making, basket making, bag making, you know, the list is actually endless. We're actually now, you know, trying to organize ourselves. We're going to campaign to get people, you know, to sponsor, you know, sponsor an entertainer. That would be our next um, campaign. And we will be looking at getting more classes done, you know, for people to come register sometime in December or January uh, coming year. So we have an awful lot of work to do. The future. The future of the angel is very bright. As the founder, I am very passionate about what I'm doing. I am in this to see the growth of entertainers, to see the day when entertainers will stop begging. I want to see the day entertainers would work, walk around with dignity. I want to see the day where parents will be very proud to allow their children to go study arts drama, music, and be proud that, yeah, my child is going to school, not a waster, not a dropout. Those are kind of all the things the NGO wants to do. It's all about teaching a person how to fish rather than giving them the fish.